Welcome. This training video covers bid codes in eTakeoff Advanced and Premier. Bid codes are used to organize measurements and to facilitate the transfer of information to Excel and other applications. The codes can be used to synchronize quantities with your estimating or accounting applications. The code from your other software, whether they are cost codes, item codes, or product codes, can be used in eTakeoff. Once bid codes are set up in eTakeoff, they can be quickly assigned to a trace in advanced or quantity worksheet items in Premier. Bid codes are made up of two parts, the code itself plus a description. The formatting of bid codes can be defined in User Preferences. Click the Settings tab and select User Preferences. Click the Bid Codes tab to review the default settings. You can define minimum and maximum lengths, allow or require digits, letters, spaces, and special characters. We have found that the default settings work best for most users. To add bid codes or edit the current bid codes, select the Settings tab and click Edit Bid Codes. The left side of the window is the list of current bid codes. If this is the first time using this feature, there will be no bid codes in this window. On the right, you can choose to add, edit, delete, or paste. Click the Add button to manually add a new bid code. Type in the code and then the description and click OK. You can edit or delete any of the current bid codes by selecting the code in the list and then clicking either Edit or Delete on the right. If you already have a coding system for your estimating or accounting software, you could copy and paste all the codes in at once. The codes from your other software need to be in CSV or Comma Separated Values format as two columns, where the first column is the code and the second column is the description. You can also copy and paste from a two-column Excel sheet. Select a rectangle of the two columns, then right-click and select Copy. Navigate back to eTakeoff and click the Paste button in the standard bid code list window. You will then get a confirmation window. Review the information and click Yes. Next, we will discuss how to add bid codes to your traces and quantity worksheet items. First, let's discuss traces in eTakeoff Advanced. Click the Settings tab and select the Edit Traces button. Now select a trace to use and double click the trace or right click and select Edit Trace. Towards the bottom left of the Trace Edit window, you will see a field called Bid Code. You can enter a code manually or click the button to select from the standard bid code list. By default, the window shows all standard bid codes. You can filter the list by typing in the first few characters of the code and then select from the filtered list. The field is case sensitive. Double click on the desired code and it will be added to the trace. Click OK to save this trace. Now, every time this trace is used for a measurement, the measurement will contain the bid code information. To show bid codes in the measurement list, open the measurement list window. Right click on any column header, like description, and place your mouse over insert column before, and select bid code from the list. You can now use bid codes to sort your measurement list or to transfer them along with your quantities to other applications. Now for Premier users, let's discuss how to add bid codes to quantity worksheet items. Open the quantity worksheet window and import your template or use the list that is currently there. Find the item you want to add a bid code to and double click the item. At the bottom of the Item Properties window is the Bid Code field. You can enter a code manually or click the button to select from the standard Bid Code list. By default, the window shows all standard bid codes. 
You can filter the list by typing in the first few characters of the code and then select from the filtered list. The field is case sensitive. Double click on the desired code and it will be added to the item. To show bid codes in the quantity worksheet, right click on any column header like breakdown code and place your mouse over insert column before and select bid code from the list. Bid codes can now be used to integrate your quantities with Excel or to copy information to your other applications. Thank you. That is the end of this video.